through our channel. Thank you so much for sharing all the love with us. The response has been overwhelming and we are motivated to do better videos. Uh, one of the most requested videos that we received is that one of the makeup brushes that I like. And I just curated a few eye brushes that I feel is extremely important for anyone who likes their application to be spot on. So in no particular order, I'm going to just pick out brushes that I really like and take you the whole series. The first one that I would like to mention is this brush by Zoeva. It's the number 320. I'll put the description below. Uh, it's got a spoky liner brush. So if you have a look at this, this is how it looks. It's got a very, very pointed tip. And I extremely love to use this brush when I'm trying to smudge my under eye coat. Even when I've put liner on top and I need to give it a little smoky effect, this does the work really well. Believe me, uh, you could do it with some other uh, like a Q-tip or something, but the precision that you get with a brush like this is amazing. The next brush is a pencil brush and the various kinds of pencil brush. I had a chance to find this at the Ambika Pillai store. If you have a close look, uh, I think a couple of years back I had seen this at a store and I really liked the way this brush was. If you see the tip is extremely flat and it helps me really deposit my color wherever I want. And the bristles are not very hard, you know, it gives you that blending effect, so I really like this one. The next one is again a pencil brush, but what I like is it's by Zoeva in the number 230, it's a glass pencil. If you take a close look, this is what it looks like. So I use this when I'm using lighter colors in the sense that if I'm using different kind of dark shades. Previous one is for a black shade, it deposits that really well. So yeah, I really like this brush because it helps you really wing out your liner and blend it in a very precise way. So I really like this brush. And the next brush that I highly recommend is one which is for your liner. With the whole print liner being such a trend right now, I thought you know, it's a good idea to get a brush which does it the job for you and is not extremely expensive. I found Color Bar to be the way there. So if you have a close look, this is what the brush looks like. It's got a very, very good tip. Uh, the bristles are not a lot, just sparsely placed. I think that's what does the trick. I absolutely love this brush. It's cost effective and absolutely a must have. Another one that I use for wing liners is by Sigma. It's a small angle and the number 365. If you take a close look, this is what the brush looks like. Now, I know that you know that brush could pretty much do the trick, but when you need a very, very sharp wing, no one does the job better than this one. Believe me, it just makes the whole process so much easier. So if you're someone who's obsessed with the wing liners, get yourself one piece. The next favorite is a smudger brush, which is again by Zoeva in the number 226. This is what the bristles look like. Um, now, I love the whole smoky effect in maybe your liner, maybe even when you place your coal. And this brush gives me that precision. It lets me get in there and do the job well. So yeah, really, really like this brush. The next three brushes are going to be blending brushes, something that you need for your eyes, basically, application of shadows. So this is my real technique. Uh, it's called the base shadow brush. If you take a close look, this is what it looks like. Um, this brush is godsend, really. I mean, although there's synthetic bristles and all of that, but this really gets the job done. You can apply a shadow precisely where you want and it gives you the pigmentation that you need. Uh, but apart from just the application, what is really, really important is to blend your eyeshadow. And I'm sure most of you would know this, the best in the industry is this blending brush by MAC. This is the 217. Uh, I think no brush recommendation kind of is complete without this brush being featured. It's a star. It's absolutely brilliant. Um, no one just does the job as good as this one. So yeah, highly, highly recommend this brush to you. The next brush is by Cryolip. It's the Premium Brush Art 9263. This brush is again a big, bigger fluffy brush, which is again for your eye application. It really, really helps you blend your shadow. Remember, no eye makeup is complete without all the colors being gradient and mixing into each other. And this brush really, really helps. Did you see like the bristles are really nice and soft and really helps you blend your eyeshadow. And the last brush, which I know a whole lot of you skip, but it's extremely important, is what you call the spoolie brush. This is what it looks like if you take a close look. I really, really like this brush. This is by Inglot and it's called 14M. 
This is for your eyebrows. You know, we all have hair which kind of trickles down over a period of time. This really helps you groom your eyebrows while you're filling it. So, must have. So, that's all my recommendations for your eye, eye brushes. I hope you like this video. Do let me know what are your favorite brushes and don't forget to hashtag Team when you put up these recommendations. I'll see you next week. Until then, take care.